thinking back on the two or three movies I've seen Jane Fonda in, in the last year or so, it's interesting how three-dimensional she is. She's not the person you see on television. She comes up with a new character every time, which is unfortunately more than you can say about another actor who's made a new film, Gabe Kaplan. He's well known to television viewers as Mr. Cotter, the fast-talking, long-suffering high school teacher of Welcome Back, Cotter. And Cotter fans, unfortunately, will have no trouble recognizing him in his new movie, Fast Break, where he plays, once again, a fast-talking, long-suffering college basketball coach. It's all just a little bit too familiar. Here's Kaplan being uh, offered the coaching job by the president of the college. It's not exactly what you'd call an irresistible offer. I'll give you $50 for every game you win. $50? Cash. A game? When you win. How many games are you going to play this year? Well, we hope to have 30. Maybe well, wait, wait, Mr. Duck, you say if I win every game, I'm going to make $2,000. $50 yeah. a game. Come on. All right. Make it 60. 60. Look, I know it's a long shot, but I'll give you room and board, $60 for every game you win, and I'll give you a regular contract if you beat Nevada State. Nevada State? Come on, it's one of the top yeah. 10 teams in the country. What are you talking about? Well, that's what makes it a long shot. I told you it was a long shot. But uh, the day you beat Nevada State, I'll give you a three year contract at 30000 a year with fringes. You know, I think you're as crazy as I am. <laughs> but I like your style. This is guaranteed $30,000 a year for three years? I promise. I just got to beat Nevada State? Yeah. Where do I get my players? Anywhere you can. What about scholarships? Well, uh, we'll give them room and board and a first-class education for any kid who wants to play with us. Some of the best players I know have a little problem uh, with academics. Not a Cad Wallander. He recruits his team from the ghetto playgrounds of New York, and here they are at halftime in the big Nevada night. State game. Stop shooting so much. Feet Preacher. Preacher's yeah, hot. Yeah, I'm, I'm open out there, Coach. I mean, set some picks or Shut something. up! Let me coach the team, all right, Preacher? Set some picks for him. He's hot. He's right. And why aren't you shooting, Swiss? You got the boy. You got shots. Take them. Don't be Mr. Nice Guy passing all the time. Take those shots when you got them. And Sam, you got three fouls on you ready. Watch that. I don't want you to foul out. And open up that offense. Open up the middle. Let Hustler get the ball. Feed him. You're not feeding him enough. And when you miss a shot, pound that offensive board. Pound it. Offensive board, Hustler. Important. Man, you putting us down. You know that? I'm sorry. This game happens to be very important to me. It's important to everybody in this room. So let's do it, all right? All right. Get a drink of water. Go to the bathroom. Kind of a nice little note there. It's kind of a good performance. Gabe Kaplan's got sincerity. He's got good timing. He's got an engaging personality. He could have tried something more original for his movie debut instead of just playing Mr. Cotter again. The movie does have some good moments, I suppose. It ends with a fairly exciting basketball game, although it's almost obligatory in a sports movie to have a game like that. But Fast Break is just so completely predictable that you don't have to be afraid to go out and buy popcorn. You're not going to miss anything. It is like an expanded TV show. We meet four of his players that he recruits from Harlem. Each guy gets about 10, 15 minutes to tell his story. They could be individual episodes in a situation comedy on television. Uh, you know, they're charging three and a half bucks to see this movie. I think we really want to see something different than we can get on the tube. We don't get it with this There's picture. another problem, too, with the characters, and that's that you get a moment of great uh, poignant insights or revelation of secrets, and then... Five minutes later, you have slapstick comedy. The movie doesn't have a line from beginning to end in terms of knowing what it wants to say about yeah. the people. Well, now to a better film. We take a dimmer view, though, of Fast Break, the Gabe Kaplan basketball comedy. It seemed like too much like a TV series, so we both say no to Fast Break.